Hello everyone and welcome in my 3D VFX channel. Today we're gonna talk about the five top text to 3D in the industry. So now we're gonna just have a look in Google and tap the text to 3D. What do we have? For me, we have five major ones. I'll try a bunch of them. Some of them are not even working or coming with presets or I never really deliver. The one who deliver and gives you the text to 3D, the proper ones are first Meshai. This one is really good. I did a lot of video about this one. Really nice. You have a bunch of credits at the beginning and you can reuse. And the text to 3D is actually working well. So here are the, the books. I did some sunglasses, butterfly, dragon, lizards. And you have the refine option. You have a quick viewport on the right when you can see what you're doing. And you can download your item. If you want to share, you can also spend some credits here. And here you have 200 credits per week, I think. Uh, I don't know when they reset, but I just add the 200 back. So this one is pretty good. Um, after we have slowed, still a beta, but this one is going to be more for the ones who want automatic uh, generation of model and maybe having a bit of um, control. So you can log in and you can quickly see what they're doing. So I'm just going to log in really fast. I hope it's not going to take too long. And here you have here the create button when you can jump into a viewport and see what happened in real time. And you can add objects type based on the library they have, uh, or you can text a high prompt here. So have a look, slide, pretty good. Uh, 3D AI, so this one was actually the best one I did the first video with. Um, I get some stuff I did before. Uh, the problem is I don't have any more credit to show, but same as the other, you have a little viewport here. You can put your prompt and see what you can use, uh, generate your prompt and generate your model. It's pretty fast. You can export in a model. You can maybe go after in Blender and from Blender, you can re-export into Maya, Udini or your favorite software, ZBrush. Um, after you have the Alpha 3D, so Alpha 3D, I was not very um, the big fan of this one. I prefer the three, the two first one, three first one. But this one comes with a bit of bunch of presets. So you can load uh, some assets based on some image and based on some uh, text. So have a look. There is some assets. You have uh, some free assets at the beginning. So that's a good one to start. And the last one, actually, the one I think the most promising and the one to follow the most closely is Tripo because I did a quick start last time and I tried a book um, and it comes with like different type of model, different type of variations. At the same time, um, I was actually very happy about the quality of the model. So have a look of Tripo. It's a good one. Um, those ones are going to be free at the beginning for sure. And after you can always see the pricing for every type of stuff. It's always work with credit now. It's kind of the, ben, the best way uh, for users. So basically, if you want two, three iteration, you can use the credits. So have a look, Meshai, Sloyd, 3D AI, uh, 3D Studio, Alpha 3D, and Triple. Okay, so have a look of those ones. Um, if you have any comments about those apps and about all they work, if you have any question, you can ask me in the comments. If you have any reaction based on this app or if you have a, another one i never show on this uh, channel please uh, um, put me on the comments or you can reach me a direct message so thanks for watching and see you on the next video